What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Spare Time Videos. If this is your first time here, give me a thumbs up. My name is Brett and today we're going to be looking at some tail lights on the Jeep JK. This is the product that we have uh, today. Uh, these are LED tail lights from Vroom Tech. Um, there's a couple different choices they have online, um, but I went through all the different comments and reviews and this one seemed to have gotten the best reviews. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what they look like. All right, right off the top, they have directions. Open these up. It's nicely packaged. Um, there's some <coughs> brackets. This looks like um, here are the tail lights. Try to open one of these up. Room tech, yep. Pretty nice. They're they're uh, plastic. I mean, it's probably what you know what's on the back of the Jeep already, but um, seem to be nice quality. Um, feel a little loose. But it looks like they're uh, it's gonna be held on with a bracket. Maybe possibly a plug and play, we'll see. And there's another there's the other one. Anyways, so um, yeah. Let's take a look at this product a little bit closer. Um, this resistor has to be mounted on this little bracket. Now they give you two pins. This is gonna be holding the bracket in the Jeep. Um, and then we have two little nuts and two little screws to fasten it down to it. Um, so we're going to go ahead and do one and take a look at it. These are actually locking uh, nuts, so uh, that's, that is on there. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to the Jeep and um, see how we use these clips to get them clipped on. All right, we're gonna go ahead and take these four screws out and see what's behind. Right there, a little bit of wiggle, boom. Okay, so we should be able to. So, oh, it's got like a little thing that's hanging on. Let's get this off. I just broke right off. with your thumb pull down there you go so go ahead and get these screws and the light put them together we'll stick them off to the side we're gonna go and clean this area off get all this off here see how the lights have just etched into the paint um, I'm just gonna use some uh, Spray turtle wax, which is fun. Gotta crap off. Yeah, it's nice and cleaned up. So going into the Jeep here, 
there is this piece of metal right here. Um, there's actually a lip here that the clips that we have to use are going to fasten to. So the clips are going to fasten on right here. And once we get both of them in here, we will slide our uh, resistor bracket in. And then we will be able to plug in our light. And then pretty much call it a day. And just like that, it's in place. So we're just going to let that dangle down just like that. So it is now in place. And we're ready to get our light and put it on. So I want to show you on these lights, um, they actually slide off of these Allen wrench nuts. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and plug this in. and tight. I'm going to go ahead and get this back in here. What we're going to do is we're going to turn, we're going to twist it into place just like that. And as we tighten these down, they're starting to catch. up a little higher oh yeah now my thing is, is you know we've got this on here make sure it's straight we're, we're, we're pulling we're pulling it to the Jeep and it's actually getting tighter and tighter around and I don't know if I want this bare plastic on my metal so you just rub another you know line in so we may go back and you know outline it with a nice uh, piece of foam uh, that way we don't do any damage to the paint now before we get ahead of ourselves we're actually going to take this and we're going to test and make sure everything works right We'll turn on our blinker. Let's check it out. There you have it. It actually blinks in the front, blinks on the side. Really cool. Uh, what we're going to do is we'll mash on the brakes um, and then we'll actually. Um, Turn the lights on and see what the just the running lights look like. And there's the actual lights. So that's actually pretty cool. It's got a uh, it's got a round effect, and it's uh, on the side as well. So um, the next thing we're gonna test is let's go ahead and put the Jeep in reverse and see if the reverse lights come on. sleek man a little bit of a gap here possibly maybe I should just try to adjust it a little bit more you know I'm gonna try to tweak it a little bit more than uh, we'll relook at it all right guys that's what it looks like straight off the back from factory to 
LED. It's pretty awesome. I got to sit down a little bit better. Not much. But um, I think I'm going to do a little gasket around it. Still really nice though. A plug that's going to go through that we're not going to mess with. So we're just going to pull this one off. Get it off. No, it slides off. No. There you go. I'm going to slide this one off. I'm trying to unplug it. Push it in. Pull it out. There you go. All right, so we're going to do this one a little bit different. Um, we're actually going to put it um, like this. And we're going to we're going to push it in over in this corner. Use a lot of force because these are really tight. <clears throat> All right, then we'll get the other camera in there. And we'll take a look at it so that way you guys know uh, where to put that. All right, so instead of using that uh, skinny one right here, it's too small. We've actually Got a resistor over here on this uh, little pinch seam. So, um, yeah, it's nice and tight. We're gonna go ahead and get this one on, and then we'll take a look at it. There we go. Put these lights back off in here. And we'll, we're gonna go ahead and loosen these up, that way it pulls off, and that way we can get it uh, mounted up. All right, guys, let's see what this looks like. Brakes on. Off the brake. Put it in reverse. There we go, very cool. These things have uh, been very simple to install. They look very sleek. Um, they are plastic, there's nothing really metal to them except for the brackets. Um, they are kind of a pain to kind of get them, you know, straight, but um, yeah, they look great. Alright guys, here they are. These things look sick. Uh, I went to the store. I've already got compliments on them. Um, so they are different. They do stick out from your typical, you know, factory. The uh, LEDs in here. Oh. You know, know how long they'll last for, but I mean, LEDs last for a long time, probably like a hundred thousand hours or so. Um, you know, it's got the backup in here, um, and then whenever you are braking, they are really, really bright. Um, but guys, this is a very simple install to do. Um, you can do this in about, you know, 20, 30 minutes or so. If you're really, really, you know, humping it and going fast. But, um, you know, I would say overall, this would probably be like an hour, hour and a half um, job. But, anyways, that's going to be it, guys. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully, this will help you guys out whenever you're going to be installing these. Uh, if this is your first time here, check out some of my other videos, and if you like them, hit that subscribe button. Um, if you like this video, give me a good thumbs up. Um, you know, in the comments below, if you guys want to uh, see me install something else, other lights, uh, just 
put it down below in the comments. Um, thank you guys so much for the views. Thank you guys for the subscribes that you've given me. I appreciate everything. Thank you guys so much. I'm going to keep rocking on. You guys keep jeeping on. If you haven't already, follow me on Instagram. Uh, currently, it is bigman06 underscore. That's most likely going to change to spare time videos. Um, also, I have a Twitter account. Um, and that's most likely going to be uh, swapping it to spare time videos as well. Um, appreciate the support. Thank you guys so much for viewing and watching my videos. Um, take care. Peace out. Keep jeeping on. Bye.